everybody welcome back to my channel today i am going to show you my august bullet journal spreads i wanted to create a new bullet journal for the new school year so let's go ahead and get right into it okay so the first thing that i'm going to do is get these gold letter stickers and spell out my name just for an opener for my bullet journal Next, I'm going to go ahead and work on the cover for August. And I went ahead and wrote down the days of August. And by the way, my bullet journal is from Muji. And I also got these pens from Target. They're actually really good. I recommend them. <laughs> Everything that I use in this video will be linked down below if you want to know. Next, I went ahead and got this printout of this tree and decided it will be perfect for the month of August. I then went ahead and got this brown piece of paper and started to cut it up into a circle. And then I went ahead and got my double tape dispenser and pasted that on. And then I went ahead and wrote down the month of August. And that's basically it for my front cover. Next, I decided to work on my overlook of August spread. So first, I decided to draw out the month of August. And I decided not to keep it neat with this and just make the lines how I wanted to. I just really like the messy look. And then also got another brown piece of paper and wrote down August on there with my white pen. And then I went ahead and just pasted that on there and put little white diamonds on there. And I also drew a flower right next to it. Next, I went ahead and got little pieces of scrapbook paper and started to rip them up into little pieces. And then I went ahead and rearranged them however I liked and pasted those on there. And then I also printed out these pictures of Taehyung and a Kuo and some books. I thought it fit with the aesthetic. And then I went ahead and pasted those on there as well. Next, I went ahead and got my washi tape and I just picked random colors that fit with the theme. Then I went ahead and wrote down a goals box. Without picking up my pen, I just went ahead and just wrote down goals and then continued it with a box. I then went ahead and wrote down the song that I'm currently listening to and I recommend this song, My Love by Eddie Kim. I think it was perfect for my bullet journal as well. And then I also got a scrapbook paper of just little birds. I thought it fit very well and I went ahead and wrote down some washi tape that I eventually moved it to the other side later on. And I also did a gold washi tape as well and a watercolored washi tape. And then I went ahead and got my sunflower stickers and I pasted that on there. And then I also did a quote about wildflowers. And then I went ahead and just drew random flowers and little tiny stars and diamonds around my bullet journal just to fill in the empty spaces that I didn't put anything in there. And I just made little random dots, new flowers, and everything like that. And then I ended up just changing my to-do list and putting in some flowers as well just to fit in with the lyrics that I put in. I then continued on with some more washi tape and some more little bubbles and dots everywhere and that's basically it. Okay, so for the next spread, I didn't want to do four pages of weekly spreads because I didn't really have time for it. So I went ahead and just did it all in two pages. So the first thing that I did was write down all the days of August. And I went ahead and drew some wild flowers that I did outside of the camera. And then I went ahead and went with my black pen and just traced them all out. I'm not a very good drawer, but I went ahead and just did whatever my heart desires and just did random flowers out of the top of my head. Next, I went ahead and wrote out August outside of the camera as well. And then I went in with my black pen and did an outline and I also did uh, kind of like a fake calligraphy I just went ahead and just bolded out the downstrokes of every single letter and yeah next I got some pieces of scrapbook paper that I had laying around and I went ahead and just pasted those on there and also some washi tape as well 
And then I went ahead and just put some dotted points and that was it for the spread. And then for the next spread, I decided to do a level 10 life. I saw this online and I thought it was a good alternative to habit trackers. So the first thing I did was write down level 10 life and did some down strokes for some fake calligraphy. Then I got my sticker book out and took these dotted stickers. Next, I got these printed out pictures of Jimin and it also fit the aesthetic of my bullet journal as well and I pasted those on there. This spread helps you on what you would like to work on in your everyday life. And then I went ahead and got some washi tape that fit with the aesthetic of the pictures. Next, I went ahead and got my gold foil washi tape and I decided to do a broken glass. So basically what I did was just to cut out into little small pieces and from the corner I did more pieces and then as you go outwards you just do less pieces. You can basically just see what I'm doing here. So next I went ahead and got my ruler and just traced out 10 pieces of sliced pie I guess and I went over with that with my black pen. I then went ahead and just wrote down each of my 10 life improvements that I want to work on on each slice of pie. I then went ahead and got my flower stamps and stamped some on the title as well. And I also got my brown piece of paper and my white pen and wrote down life finds a way. Next I decided to just draw out some little leaves and flowers and hearts and just some little dots everywhere and little bubbles just to fill out the empty spots that I had. And then I went ahead and drew out whatever I desired onto my little life pie chart. And whatever I worked on, I can go ahead and color it in. And now this spread is finished. And that's basically it for my bullet journal. I loved how it turned out. And so this is basically how it looks like when it's all filled out. I didn't write anything for goals because I'm still thinking about them. But this is how it looks like and yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching and let me know if you want to see other bullet journal videos and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!